This is Rick with Shooter 1721 back with the Benjamin Wildfire. We have set up for you the chronograph test. So we want to walk through the chronograph and you can see we got the Premier, the Hobby, the Meister Krugen, Diablo Basic and some Gamo locks. And we have the, as you can see, the chronograph set there. We have some other pellets for testing today too. We're going to see how this does. We're going to give you a five shot string five shots for each pellet kind of see what the average is and we'll go from there so here's our chronograph part two has begun and here we go with the chronograph test we got a, a camera on the chronograph and then this is what's up first across from Premier 10.9s so we're going to shoot these across the crony and see what we get here hopefully get the crony working it's in the sunlight so 537 sounded a lot harder 614 605 595 606 so that's kind of interesting okay after we did some more chrono testing when we were out there um, what had happened was I had shot all 25 shots straight down the tube and uh, what I realized is when I went back and shot a uh, 5 to 10 shot string on each one, I noticed that the feet per second went up almost 50, 60, 80 feet per second in some cases. So I don't feel like I gave it a fair chronograph shake there, if, if you will. I feel like I, I need to redo some more of the chronograph because as I refilled and went back to 2000 and came back through the shot string, Boy, I, I even saw uh, Lux in the 800s. So I think I'm going to go back, redo that, and send that back out. So let me rework on the chronograph. I rushed yesterday because of a storm. We had a tornado warning in February. Just had to rush through that. I shouldn't have done that. So I'm going to redo that and uh, take a look at it and see what I'll send the results out. Now let's get back to doing some shooting. Have some fun. First up. Premier super match. We're going to shoot these at five shot group, see what we get. With a gusting wind of 25 miles an hour today. I don't know if you can hear it, it's ridiculous. So we're going to see if we can get this in here, see if we can get a decent boom. up next crossman destroyer i think there's a storm coming i believe it's february 70 degrees and, and i feel like there's a storm heading on us so filming this week has been terrible so we're going to see if we can get a five shot now on the destroyer too bad on the destroyer seemed okay these are just regular crossman wide cutters now so we're just going to run through these here see what we get here Got one extra, I think, there, but not bad. Not bad at 20. And last but not least, Premier's pointed. I'm trying to beat a storm, guys. <laughs> so we'll get these in too. So let's see if we can get this in.
wanted to shoot just a couple extra there just to see how they did you guys got to remember this is a this gun's made for plinking this gun is not made for going out hunting uh, small game or anything like that this is sheer fun Benjamin wildfire is built for fun and plinking and sh it sure does that and uh, we are going to run it through some see if we can get some trick shots done with it and everybody knows how heavy the trigger pull is and but uh, it, it shoots decent groups. I mean, it's shooting decent. Uh, I think some, you know, some of them, the best group I had was uh, a little under an inch. I had a couple under an inch and they were Meister Krugens at like those. And the Super Match, it'll shoot. If we didn't have this gust and wind, I think that they would shoot under an inch also. Remember, as you watch this review, this gun's built for fun, guys. Don't get wrapped up so much in, oh, it's a PCP. It's $149.99. And you get to go out and have fun with your son, with your brother, you know, with your daughter. You know, go out and have some fun shooting the Benjamin Wildfire. It is a lot of fun. Maybe you just went to Benjamin Wildfire just to cut a playing card. I don't know. I'd say that's pretty well cut. One shot. Benjamin Wildfire. Or maybe you want the Wildfire for this. Splitting the pellet. Benjamin Wildfire, look out. Or maybe you want it for shooting an aspirin tablet off a balloon. Woo! There it is, baby. The wildfire has some accuracy. You're just kind of like, oh yeah, it's a plinker. Well, I do a lot of shooting. There you go. That was pretty smooth. Let's see something else. Well, here we are at the end of the video. And uh, guys, I, I walked the wildfire through. You gotta remember, this gun's designed for plinking, having fun. I put up the old school days. Here we go, we got the cans. We got the bloom, but I hope you like the review of the wildfire. We'll walk you through a lot of things with it. But for me, as a trick shot guy, I, I think this gun's going to be a lot of fun. So let's go. Uh, let's go have some fun. All right. Woo! And there you go, Benjamin Wildfire, putting the cans down. This is Rick from Shooter1721. Thanks for watching.